when i decided to go for this seven day detox for the first time it was mainly to deal with bloating i was constantly bloated and i did not like it i needed to heal my gut i needed to purge my system of all the junk food and bad substances i must have ingested especially all through my vacation and i needed to deal with the puffiness that came with waking up every morning like my morning puffy face oh my god i found out that detoxing is way more than that like it goes way beyond that and that is what i plan to share with you in this video well for the next seven days the body naturally detoxifies itself okay your body gets rid of toxins using the liver the purpose of detoxification is to take drinks and foods that aid the liver to perform its main function of detoxifying the body more effectively hi guys my name is ds ds allen here in this video i'll be sharing with you my realistic seven day detox process all the things that i ate all the things that i drank the exercise routines the results that i got both expected ones and surprising ones if you're not subscribed to my channel ensure you subscribe put on your post notification bell so that you will know when next i post a new video so over the next seven days you will take this journey along with me and who knows you might be inspired to follow my pattern as the days went by i kept on writing all the things that i experienced so i would not forget okay so now the plan that i made consisted of 10 things basically avoid caffeine in form of coffee and black tea drink lots of water eat more fruits and vegetables have a food timetable avoid alcohol reduce salt intake Eat only whole foods, no processed foods and junk. Drink more green teas. Avoid bad energy and don't let negative energies into my space. Rest well. So, wanna find out how this all went? Keep watching. I made my tea leaves combination. So in my previous video, if you've not seen the video, you should go check it out, okay? In my previous video, I shared with you my latest tea ingredients combination, all the healthy ingredients you can think of, ginger, lemon leaves, cinnamon, cumin seeds. You would be surprised the tea ingredients you would find around you. I never thought I would get these ingredients around me, but it was when my friend gifted them to me, I realized, oh, all of these healthy teas that they talk about, they are around. When it comes to detoxification, you stick to tea leaves, okay? Natural tea ingredients they help to clean your digestive tract boost up your metabolism and to heal your gut on a general basis because they have anti-inflammatory properties for breakfast i had oatmeal with bananas apple and dates if you're on a detox and you're not taking oatmeal what are you doing <laughs> oatmeal is a high fiber and whole grain food it is healthy for providing antioxidants which reduce blood pressure and inflammation it is good for reducing blood sugar and relieving constipation all of which help in losing weight honestly it's not like i went into this with the plan to lose weight okay that wasn't part of my goals but i knew that it was going to happen as a result of the detoxification if you're looking to lose weight oatmeal very good and then also the toppings fruits apples an apple a day keeps the doctor away Fruits are generally packed with essential vitamins like vitamin A and C as well as nutrients that the body needs to control cholesterol levels to deal with heart disease, blood pressure and so on. Dates are healthy substitutes for refined sugar and the dried fruits helps to improve the skin, reduce belly fat, help with inflammation and so on and so forth. They have a high concentration of antioxidants all through these days you would notice one common thing among all the food ingredients they are whole grain high in fiber high in antioxidants antioxidants fiber very necessary when it comes to detoxifying your body system I 
I went ahead to make cabbage sauce. I'm not a professional. I'm just explaining my experience and what I found out, okay? The cabbage sauce was packed with nutrients which are rich in fiber, vitamin C and K which are good for the digestive system and the heart. I put so much pepper in this cabbage sauce. Oh my god. It is also good to stick to seasonal fruits, okay? Fruits that you have readily available. You can make a bowl of seasonal fruits mixtures. After having a hot dinner of cabbage sauce, mango was the best dessert to end the night with. I also exercised. I did my regular cardio and stretch exercises. than I usually eat. For someone that skips most meals except dinner, I eat a lot. But I did not really feel any effect if I'm being honest. So it's just like, okay, I was just drinking lots of water, I was peeing a lot, I was eating healthy meals and I was just normal for the first day. <laughs> so if you're enjoying this video so far, give it a thumbs up comment your thoughts below on your first day if you're going along with this my seven day plan if you're on this journey comment your first day what you ate the results of your first day that's if you felt any effect or if you felt any result your first day i'll see you in day two